Hey there guys, Joe here, and I'm going to be doing a tutorial for you guys for setting up live commentary on your PlayStation, Xbox, Wii, whatever. Because I finally got mine set up, and it was ridiculous the amount of tutorials I had to go through to find what I needed to do. I went through like three of them before I finally found out what I needed to do for mine. And it was just a pain in the ass. I didn't like doing it. So hopefully I can get a clear one for you guys if you ever need to want. Alright guys, so here's the equipment list you'll need. Actually, here's the equipment bed you'll need, but uh, <laughs> we'll go through the things individually. So, you'll need two of these, or one pair, one pair. sometimes they come together. They're just basically um, like little extension pieces for your audio cables. You'll need a mic with an XLR input. Um, you will not be able to use USB for this. There are no USB points on the mixer. You'll need two pairs of component cables. This one will usually come with your HD, well, will come with your HD PVR, and the other ones you can get at Radio Shack and whatnot for your PS3. You'll need three pairs of audio cables, um, just the red and white. That's audio. You can use the yellow. Well, sometimes they come in all three. Just don't put, plug the yellow in. You'll need four of these adapters. They are RCA, whoop, the stereo adapters, and they'll be going into your mixing board. This is a uh, Behringer Zenix 502. It's about the most most cheapest, about the cheapest one you can get on the market. They're usually thirty to forty dollars, but you will need that. The other thing you will need is a TV with audio out in the back. If you do not have an audio out output in your TV, this will not work for you. Your HD PVR, um, <coughs> excuse me, they are about two hundred dollars, so that'll be your other big costly item if you don't have a gaming system. So you need a gaming system, you know, beautiful, sexy paint job, optional, but it doesn't hurt. So let's get started. Okay, now for the sake of this tutorial, I have my TV turned around so we can see all the outputs from the TV, and I've got my PlayStation, PVR, and Mixer all lined up. The first thing you're going to want to do is hook up your PS3 to your PVR. So you're going to take your PS3 component cable and you know, just plug it into the back. see. <laughs> okay, so it's plugged in. Now you've got your cables here. Separate the two audio ones. Um, on this cable I have there, separated. You can see audio. Red and white. <clears throat> so, get those out of the way. And all we want, all we're interested in right now is our red, blue, and green cables. And they are going to go into the in column of your PVR. So, match the colors. Red. It's a blue. <clears throat> it's a green. And we're going to leave the audio out. I know it seems weird, but it'll make sense. So now that we've got that in, we're going to grab the component cables that came with the PVR and run them from the PVR to the TV. Again, we only want the red, blue, and green. So, plug them in first. That's green. And blue. Okay. And your audio cables are just kind of out. Take the other end. Go to your TV. Red. Blue. And green. Again, we're leaving the audio out. It'll make sense later. Okay, so so far we've got these six cables in here. We've got three in there. Your audios should not be plugged in at all. Now we're going to take our two audios from the PS3 components and you're going to put your two little extenders on them. Okay, easy enough. And then you're going to grab one of your audio cables, match the colors up, red to red, white to white. We're going to take the other end and plug it into here. Again, white to white, red to red. So now we've got a full set here. And you've got these down here. Okay, now we're going to set up the mixer. 
So first things first, you just plug your mic in. Uh, that goes into the, just this spot here. Okay. And you're going to grab two of your adapters. Um, make sure you get the mono adapters versus the stereo adapters. Uh, we'll put them on the PVR. And you'll notice a difference. Zoom in a little bit. Okay, the mono adapter has got the one line down there. The stereo has two. This mixer, it's the wrong way. <clears throat> this mixer only holds um, mono. If you zoom in there, it's a mono line only, so the stereo won't work. Or in my experience, it didn't work. It may work for some others. I don't know. But just get the stereo ones. Or the <laughs> don't get the stereo ones. Get the mono ones. Easy way to check is by looking for that line at the bottom. So you're going to use either line 2, 3, or 4, 5. It doesn't matter. So we'll use 2, 3. Plug two of them in. And grab another pair of your audio cables. Okay, you're going to match them up. Right is red. White is left. So, left and right. And this is going to go ah, okay, into the audio out of your TV. Right here. Okay, see? Under my cable there. Audio out. Kind of see it. <laughs> okay, and this is crucial. If you don't have this, this, is not, this setup will not work out for you. So we've got that in. Next, you're going to grab your other two adapters here, and you're going to see a main out. You're going to plug them into there. Grab your audio, your third audio cable. Again, right red, left white. There we go. <laughs> Then you're going to take the other end of that, and this end is going into your PVR, ooh, excuse me, in column focus. Oh, well. <laughs> it's going into the in column of your PVR. Okay, so it's going to take the sound from the TV, put it into the mixer, shoot it to the PVR, and then you'll have the... where to go? I've got wire hell here. The USB cable that came with your PVR. You'll plug that in. Come on. And then that leads up to your laptop. And when everything's on, it'll come up. Now you're not going to hear any sound at first. That's because when you get your mixer, None of these levels are adjusted. So, what you need to do, okay, so mine is in line 4 5. So, I'll look down at the mixer, and here we go 4 5. This will be your volume here. So, if we want more volume from the game, if we want a higher game volume, you'll turn this up. Less game volume, turn it down. Your mic is, lo is slot 1. So, here's your mic. If you want more voice, your less voice turn it down, more voice turn it up. Your overall volume combined is over here on your main mix. So either bring that up or down. Okay, and then just for review, you're going to run your component cable from your PS3 into the in slot of your PVR. You're going to run your component cable from your TV from the back there into your um, out of your PVR. No audio cables plugged in. Then you're going to run audio out into the in of your mixing board. And the out of your mixing board will run into the in of your PVR. And also your left and right component audio is attached to your audio cables from your PS3 component set. And the whole thing makes a complete circuit. And as long as your PVR is plugged into your laptop, you'll have you'll be able to record live commentary. Works very well. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. Um, I hope the tutorial helped you a lot. If you have any questions, leave them in a the comment. Uh, if you enjoyed the tutorial, give it a thumbs up. If you didn't, give it a thumbs down. So let me know why, what was confusing, what I didn't do. Um, if you need more tutorials or help on something, let me know. I'll do the best I can. 
Um, if this is one of your first videos of me, you enjoyed it, subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching.